Hey Aries, welcome to Turn Hill. Welcome to the place where we turn Hill our way to self love and unity consciousness. I hope all is well. Luck here. Happy New Year. Happy holidays and all that. All right. Welcome to your reading for the month. Okay. Now cards. Now everything want to fall on the floor. Welcome to your reading for the month or oh, whenever you choose to watch it it's all good and let us get started i come to you humbly god thanking you for your divine guidance providing messages of divine light divine love in accordance with your divine will what is it that we need to know what does the aquarius oh my god i said aquarius aries collective need to know some of you guys you might be dealing with an aquarius or have aquarius placements if so this thing might be for you okay all right let's go all right so we're starting off with the Queen of Cups in reverse. That Queen of Cups in reverse. Um, someone is out of sorts emotionally, is what I'm getting. This could be with someone else, but someone is definitely not in their best mind. Um, their emotions are a bit scattered, all right? Um, and I feel like someone is looping. Their mind is playing tricks on them a little bit. That's what I'm getting, all right? See, someone could be, you know, you know, sometimes we get into these moments where you know if we're feeling hurt for example or if we're feeling uncomfortable or unsafe our mind might start to go elsewhere um into a place that's not really reality might be some paranoia you know whatever the case is either way is leading someone to not feel good um but the thing is prior to that with the queen of swords somebody was very clear at some point so i'm not sure what where would happen here Someone started to overthink. They were clear, then they started overthinking. Why? What happened? We'll get into it. All right. Look, I think someone just stirred up some, just stirred up some chaos, okay? This could be with someone else. Um, I don't know if you stirred up your own chaos. Maybe things got too cool. Maybe things got too clear. And maybe things got too happy. And then you just said, let me fuck it up. I don't know. Or you were chilling and then somebody said, you look too cool. Let me fuck it up. I don't know what happened, but it's still waters. And then it's just tornado energy, you know, and it's just, it just seems unnecessary to be honest. It feels unnecessary. If it's someone else doing this to you, then it's like, they're just being petty, right? Because they don't want you to be, be happy, you know? Um, okay, let's dig in, let's dig in. Let's dig into this Queen of Cups in reverse. So this energy, this confusion, see, it's this turmoil, this inner turmoil, this inner tornado. I mean, someone is just living in an emotional storm right now. That's what I'm getting. They're trying to power through. They're trying to push through it. They're trying to make sense of things. It just doesn't make sense. None of, this reading doesn't make sense to me right now. And I guess maybe this is how they're feeling. They're like, I should be happy and I'm not. This doesn't make sense. I'm not sure. Let's let's continue to dig. All right. Sun card. Cause here's why it doesn't make sense. Because here we are with the sun card in in your subconscious energy. Deep down you feel fine. Like the waters are very still in the deepest part of your ocean, the ocean being your emotions. But at the top of it, it's just some stupid waves, I guess, because a boat is flying, a boat is driving through a speedboat and it's causing these ripples. But internally, like deep down, you're feeling fine. So I just don't understand. This could just be like everyday just annoyances, I guess. It does feel very light, not light. It feels superficial and it feels petty. It could be petty if it's coming from someone else. You might be annoyed easily or frazzled easily. Is that what's happening? All right. But ultimately you're feeling good, right? You're feeling happy. That's what it is. All right. You know where you need to go. Okay. 
oh you know what it is you know what is what this is giving off you know exactly where you need to go but it's like if things aren't working your way then you kind of get easily frazzled because it's like these things that are bothering you it shouldn't be it, it shouldn't be bothering you that's what i'm getting it shouldn't be getting to you like that but it's not it's not hitting you at your core these aren't like life-changing annoyances these are just minor inconveniences that are happening um that's what i'm getting there but it's it's throwing your emotions off it's throwing your emotions off even though you have this deep knowingness that everything will be okay hmm. okay It's like if you're getting promoted, right, and you know you're about to get the, you know you're going to get the new job. You already know it. It's already locked in. Um, but then they have to go through the background check, right? Um, they just have to go through these things and maybe something happened with the company. So it got delayed and you're like, oh my gosh. And you're just like annoyed. And then it's because you're getting annoyed with that. Now you're like, am I really going to get the job? Is it really going to work out for me? Even though deep down, you know, of course, it's going to work out. You already got the job. You already signed more and so blah, blah, blah. They just have to go through, through these formalities. But it's these slight annoyances that are now messing with your spirit. Like, don't do this. <laughs> don't, don't, don't allow yourself to be so frazzled like that, okay? I mean, it is what it is, but... Just try to be mindful of that because you don't want to start acting on that and then start to create this domino effect based on some frivolous bullshit, you know? What's a blockage here? What's a blockage here for Aries? There's too many cards. It is me. Oh, it's like causing whatever it is that you're going for. It's causing like some self-doubt, you know, things like that. It's throwing you off your game. Oh, it's just like ego hits. You're getting, oh, your ego is just getting bruised. Okay. Everything will be all right. Everything will be all right with the justice card. You, I don't know what the situation is. This will be different for everyone. And there's a spectrum of how serious this goal is. Okay. Um, it could be as small as, hey, I have to, I had to drive to, um my auntie's house for christmas dinner and it was traffic and then i tried to run to the store and it was a long line right but ultimately you know you're gonna get to christmas dinner you just have these weird annoyances happening it could be as light as that it can be as heavy as other things like trying to move and you know the movers broke something right these are annoyances but in the bigger picture you're still moving right so there's a need to have some perspective here so you don't get too frazzled be annoyed sure but just don't let it <clears throat> sit and fester you know just remind yourself like hey everything's gonna be okay in the broader scheme of things it's gonna be okay um i think there's the reason why this is coming up there might be a tendency to spiral um because you know one bad thing happens and then it's just like oh now everything is wrong as opposed to being able to say okay that happened keep keep moving ahead keep forging uh ahead here um everything will be okay justice card everything will be okay whatever it is that you're going for everything will be okay all right all right cool what else we got going on here We have the strength card coming out in reverse with the Queen of Pentacles. You know, it's it's just, you know what it is. It's just the worry that, okay. It's the worry that comes from, okay, okay. You want something really bad and it's the worry that comes from wanting something that bad. You're going to freak out right and you you're gonna have to just manage that because you can have the you can possibly spiral and make things worse right you get mad about the 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 traffic 
and because you get mad about the traffic now you hit someone's car you know now now you have a real reason to be bad right because that one thing that happened because you're in the traffic and you couldn't manage your emotions in that moment now you're like rushing and ah and then you make a mistake hit a car and now you have a bigger issue a real reason to be mad so that's an example of a minor inconvenience spiraling into something bigger and sabotaging seven of seven of swords is coming through here i don't feel like this is external energy i feel like this is you you were already clear you were already happy you you were doing your thing in this in this good clear zone and then you do something to kind of just create chaos all right, so just be mindful of that. I don't know. This could be this could be many reasons why, okay? Minor inconveniences cause a spiral and now you're creating chaos by accident. Or it could be, you know, someone who's just not used to everything be it working out for them and then causing chaos, right? Because that's a thing, all right? Um, according to my therapist, okay? Um, but yeah. It happens. So just be mindful of that. It seems like that's something that might be going on there. Um, and then also the fear, it's really just stemming from fear. Uh, fear of something not working out. Fear of not getting the thing that you actually desire. And not feeling completely secure that you're actually going to get it. So that's, that's why this justice card is coming through as validation. Take a chill pill. Everything will work out. It will work out. Even if you don't trust it, it's fine. But don't don't start fucking up things because you you you're not sure. All right. Tell yourself when you find yourself going into these moments of a spiral or creating some madness for no reason, everything's gonna be okay. I am aligned with with the peace in this situation. I am aligned with peace right now i'm going to choose a high vibration right now amen i'm gonna choose a high vibration i ain't gonna let this thing bring me down it ain't gonna throw me off my game absolutely not okay um you're gonna have to talk yourself out of this out of this shit when it happens okay because i feel like it's something that happens all right um and it's just something to manage now all right let's pull from the animal sphere deck <clears throat> Believe in yourself, squirrel, squirrel spirit. Believe in yourself. See, this going back and forth, you're doing the right thing, and then you get in your head, and then you fuck up. That's because it's just you're not feeling secure about doing the right thing. You are doing the right thing. Everything will be okay. Just keep moving forward, and don't look back. When we look at horror movies, People die in the movies when they look back at the killer, right? All right, cool. Don't do that. Don't be that guy, all right? Just keep going. Keep moving forward. You'll be fine. I don't know why I made a horror movie reference. I don't even watch horror movies. Anyway, moving on. Keep building. You're doing well. Pat yourself on the back. Let me clap it up for you, all right? Keep moving forward. You're doing okay. All right, cool. All right, well, let me know what you think, Aries. Um, feel free to like, subscribe, share, comment, add me on IG, Taryn Hill, add me on the talk, add me on the Twitters and all that, all right? Um, if you want a personal reading, check out the info box below. If you want to be an angel donor, you can check out the uh, Patreon link below. I appreciate it. Thank you for the Patreon's patrons so far. Um, and yeah, until we meet again, peace.